Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve an example on real numbers. The question is the lowest common multiple of smallest two digit composite number and smallest composite number is. So the composite number first of all is the numbers like 4, 6, 8, 9, 10 and so on. These are called as composite numbers because they have multiple divisors. For example, 4 can be divided by 1, it can be divided by 2 and it can be divided by itself. So it has more than 2 divisors. And now for example if we take 8, 8 can be divided by 1, it can be divided by 2, it can be divided by 4 and it can be divided by itself. So we can see that it has multiple divisors. So these are called as composite numbers. Now they want us to find the LCM of smallest two digit composite number. So the smallest two digit composite number we can think of is 10 because the two digit numbers start with 10. And 10 has multiple divisors like 1, 2, 5 and itself 10. So the smallest two digit composite number we can consider here is 10 and smallest composite number means they are talking about one digit. So one digit it starts with 4 because 4 could be divided by 1, 2 and 4 as we had seen previously. So they want us to find out the LCM between the two. So I am going to use the prime factorization method where I am going to prime factorize both the numbers. So 4 can be divided by 2 so 2 times 2 is 4 and again 2 times 1 is 2. So the factors of 4 are 2 times 2 times 1. These three numbers. Let me prime factorize 10. So 10 goes in the table of 2. 2 times 5 is 10. And 5 1 times is 5. So the factors of 10 are going to be 2 times 5 times 1. Now to find out the LCM of these two numbers, we are going to circle out the common numbers between the two. That is 2 and 2. It is common. So in the LCM we are going to write the common number only once and rest all non-common numbers I am going to multiply with the common number. So 5 times 2 times 1. So here we get 2 times 5 is 10 and 10 times 2 is 20. So the LCM of 4 and 10 is 20. So the option is C. I hope you have understood the method. And thanks for watching.